from the table employee where the employee id has to match with the id that was given in the retrieve.html page so once you give this query the value of the query that is the result whatever records have matched with the employee id as the one given in the retrieve.html page will be returned to the variable dollar result so from this result it might even contain multiple rows so you have to fetch each row using mysqli underscore fetch underscore array and this will be stored in the dollar row variable so here you can print each field value has dollar row eid dollar row employee name dollar row date of birth dollar row date of joining and dollar row experience so now we'll see how the program works in the browser we need to give as http colon slash slash localhost colon double five double five slash the employee which is the for this employee is the folder in which the files have been given and retrieve.html is the file that we will be executing now so i am going to give the id as 21 which was just the value i had inserted shortly and when i give search i get the database is connected and the details of the employee with the employee id is 21 so that is 21 which is the employee id hansi which is the name of the employee 17 not 1 1997 is the year of date of birth and uh, not 1 not 1 2015 is the date of joining and 2 here is the experience so in this program we have seen how to connect php to database to insert some records into the database and how we can retrieve the value from the database i hope this tutorial was useful for you thank you